More than 8 million people call New York City home, and over the past few days, the seven members of BTS have managed to seemingly take over the city as the guys cozied up with Jimmy Fallon and nearly shut down Times Square Wednesday on Good Morning America. BTS certainly made the most of their first ever appearance on a U.S. morning show performing Idol and sitting down for an interview where they talked about everything from their sold out Love Yourself tour, their speech at the U.N., and of course, took time to thank you, ARMY. It's all because of, you know, like, ARMY's like here and... On the topic of the theme behind Love Yourself, RM told GMA, we thought that, you know, the most thing that especially the young generation needed is that true love begins, first begins with loving myself. So we thought true love first begins with loving ourselves, and we're trying to love ourselves too, and I hope the armies can do the same. Early mornings and very late nights. That's been BTS's life while in town over the past week, and just hours before Good Morning America, the guys sat down with Jimmy Fallon on The Tonight Show Tuesday. BTS suited up for a Fortnite dance challenge alongside Fallon. <laughs> and also chatted about their UN speech with the late night host. You know, to truly love ourselves is important to you know, firstly know who I am and, you know, where I'm from and what my name is and what my voice is, kind of like that. All right, I think that's everything for right now, so let's toss it to you and get your thoughts and reactions on the past few days. Sianna pointing out, at Jimmy Fallon and at GMA were so welcoming towards BTS, you could really tell how comfortable they were. It was also great to see them ask about their UN speech and the meaning behind their album, instead of just mentioning their social media following. I Love Me from Ethiopia wrote in, An army from Ethiopia, I thoroughly enjoyed both shows. BTS enjoyed themselves to the fullest as well. Thank you for giving BTS a chance, and I want to tell the boys that Ethiopian armies really love them so much. Hashtag Speak Yourself chimes in too. I love how comfortable Jimmy made them feel and let them have fun with the Fortnite challenge. But most importantly, I'm so happy to see that many armies went to New York this morning to show that BTS has tons of fans here and we love them so much. And Ava wrapping things up saying, biggest boy band on the planet. Yep, that's BTS. Both interviews and performances were so much fun to watch. It shows how much BTS really cares for ARMY and their message of their Love Yourself campaign. I hope they continue to have more interviews like these. All right, for a deeper dive and a better understanding, you can check out Tamar Herman's articles up now on Billboard.com. And until next time for Billboard News, 